probably part of the most impatient there. This the oh, water deep than this not I already killed it. I don't want to flash for him, but this Reaper is so slow. Just going in a right click. Is he trying to kill still me or something? What is going on? That E juke by him was kinda nice, but he still has to go into us and get fucked. Yeah, he doesn't feel like farming his camps. I hope he gets a double kill. I wish him the best. Well played, team. Yeah, he gets a double kill. Yeah, so I'm both with him. Never mind, it's fine. He just got a 70 gold assist. Oh, I'm getting pinged! Catch the wave. We got places to go. What are I gonna do to you, bro? Play Kassadin. <gasps> oh, that's so bad now, I don't heal enough. <sighs> I could heal the full HP almost. Oh, yeah, I missed a hit. But it doesn't come anyway. He's just giving up on his life. Conqueror because it's good here. Or oh, Conqueror will be bad on Volleyball. I think we cut back down. That's a low tough place. How did he get a kill bro? Why is Zara recalling that after seeing Nocturne move on two words? I'm gonna go around because I want to get this dragon. And also set up more stuff, since bot lane is easier to kill. I'd rather grab this kind of useless, except my top player could get some plates probably, because he's winning. Maybe my Victor. If you guys don't die, if Nocturne goes for his red buff maybe... Or Krags. He already did Krugs so though. He didn't do Krugs when he ganked. He might be on his red buff. There he is. And boom. Now what? Bro? Oh, you dashed on these nuts with Kassani. Congrats. Get the fuck down. <laughs> fuck, Tua. Let's get the dragon. It's kind of OP to have Ocean. And I want to deny it from enemy team because Ocean is kind of strong versus uh, these three champs. Because they try to pull. They might try to execute someone. By the Andris and Blackfire Torch and whatnot. Could have Black Cleaver here, so it's base. Oh yeah bro, go back bot, while you invade topside. Bot lane is important here. It'll help your lovely Zyra, so that everyone doesn't get fed. What is Nocturne even doing? There's no he's on the grabs. It's even good that he went back bot lane. He took wolves. Now he might die again. Hopefully. They're a bit handless. No, now they just overextend. That's looking really rough, because they fucked up the kill, they wasted a lot of cooldowns. Yeah. I'm getting pinged of course, because they love running it down on purpose. Maybe they might use this plant, let's see. I already, I don't, didn't have PTA there to kill. Like real flash maybe? Which cancels me. Hit him. That's not good. You could die to Draven now. Maybe Draven will. It's probably on cooldown, they just took a fight, but still. I was pretty sure his spell shield is down. Now I have no cooldowns, I'll just farm my entire jungle reset. 
But I almost fucked up the kill because I forgot I don't have PDA. I could really use mercs here, they are really good, but I think just having steel caps to stat check them is gonna be a bit more useful. Don't really need tenacity that much. Could be top. He has a big shadow. Could be dead. And the copy. Let's see, it's not very good. Nice for me to get a kill here. Then dark seal. Ah. Still a stack, it's not the end of the world. Draven is quite desync with Draven. Well, Draven players are really big tilters, so he's probably gonna walk up here, die, and then sell his items. I don't know why Velkos is showing, because he could have had a word maybe. A bit late. So, whatever. I take the roll on the that and then the wave. That's okay, of course, will be out. If Nocturne wasn't here, I would just die for it. But I don't want to risk it because Draven is coming out of base too. It's very important to take gold away from champions like this because Velkos and Zyra don't need gold to be useful. Volibear needs gold to be useful. The champions can be 10k gold behind enemies and still do their job from their base kit. I don't have an AD carry even. I think that this guy went super quickly. He goes still caps here, probably kills Nocturne as well. Would be much healthier. Okay. He doesn't. Uh, what? Could have no floppy, but eh, it's just not necessary. Then maybe I'll get another opportunity to die or kill Raven here. See this guy is uh, kind of griefing right now. Says my lovely teammate. No idea how my entire team is dying. You guys are special. I should have probably protected Zyra's recall from Cassidy here. What? She's 1 HP? Barely dodges my E and then has ult? She just didn't use ulti that whole fight because she had it up. Yes, comedian. He's gonna mark him with W. And I go into the jungle to get some mana. So Volber has a full mana in here. Give another perfect shot on the castle, this is really bad. No mana, a mega chain CC. Yeah, just so unnecessary, really. I should probably buy a hard seal when I'm this ahead in a game like this. I'm gonna get a lot of hard steel stacks here, they don't have any percentage max cell damage, except for Poppy Q, I don't even cover it to be fair, it's so whatever. Kassadi has three items now, the game is getting really, really scary, he's, he's gonna clean up everyone. And they keep just griefing on purpose over and over and over, super unnecessary, that's, I think we might be faced and doesn't actually get. Victor will get killed as well because Seth didn't wait for me to come. Oh well. I better just ulti out, if I get hit by once to see I probably die. So, we might lose the game here. It is what it is, my teammates continue to over and over and over make really stupid mistakes. We are gonna lose Nash here, and then Kassan is gonna be level 16, and if we continue to play like this, we lose. Sometimes we just lose games. Not much you can do about it. Just here, but by W, which should be fun. 
play Red Mist class. And because of their grief, we didn't even get the third dragon. I have no idea how, because we killed everyone with Victor, right? We killed literally everyone, and then my team didn't get the third dragon somehow. I have to control the Kassadin with my CC. I don't have magic resistance yet, so... Yeah, it's gonna hurt a lot. Just getting a pen kill again, it's crazy. I don't know, I'm, I'm trying, so I'm trying. Okay. I just need to peel my teammates from Kassadin, but... How can I peel my Volkos when he's split pushing and dying for fun? I'm starting to get some hearts in stick, so at least that's not too bad. I think I should probably get a strike to have enough tenacity to be able to hit him. Why the speed visage and try to kill my team off for the next dragon. They keep making plays like this. This is so uh, terrible. He's gonna be dead for the objective and... Now they go in to try to help him and they lose the game. It's so unbearable. You cannot win with these people. Seth is going in as well. Hopefully he cleans up. They ran into so many abilities. Okay, that actually ended up being fine. And make him just over chased. Hey, look at this guy. My warrior is just trolling, he's FK farming. With 20 kills. We all put a report on this volley for carrying this 1v5. He said. Let's try to get W for our super. Wait, I don't even know if W hurts my heart, so I completely forget. I'm gonna mark this poppy. I'll try to break one with my heart still. For my character, actually. I can catch him, I'm getting directly blocked. But I did have some unnecessary deaths for funning a bit. I'm not like full try harding. But what does that have to do with anything? Wait, did I cancel her out? Like seriously now, what can I do about my team eating? Let's group on FF, I mean you never wanted to group, you are just throwing. That's the problem. That's what he's been doing the whole game. If I... Okay, maybe we can get a better here. It's kind of crazy that the Twilight and Poppy can store so much time and still not die when we have champions that are pretty good at killing. Losers, thanks, whatever, we have black cleavers too. I just think Poppy is just way too mobile. They need her for movement speed like base or something. This Dreva still doesn't know how Volibear works by the way. Wait, my entire team died to Kassadin. Enemy triple kill. That's a bit my fault. To be fair, I expected Seth to control the Kassadin. Come on, man. That doesn't matter that much, Kassadin is already full build, so him getting triple kill is literally pretty useless because he really cannot buy more items. Trying it. Behind. I don't have much amount, I think it will melt me in the long run. Okay. Let's hope we don't get aced by Kassadin. 
hoping, I'm hoping, I'm hoping and praying. He got the triple kill again. But he's dead. He's dead and he has no cooldowns. Fucking ugly, you play this. The movement speed item here. I have to go full breaker. But that's fine, now we can get the soul. My full breaker pro does 1k damage with scratchers. It's just not much I can do, man. They've been eating the Kassadin all game. Even in this fight, they're just running in the jungle like bots. Kassadin is a bit late, he has no TP. He's really good with the points of fight. At this point, I'll just. Kill the skid. Eventually. Remove the Draven. Ideally, we don't get Penta killed by Kassadin again. Please and please shove the wave. Because you could have even ended here. I don't think it's a waste. Just need to waste for my smite here because I'll still have Flare Trap for the Elder. Or maybe Soul if we don't get it somehow. But Kassadin is still here to try to steal or Penta kill. You just have to stand next to my teammates. That's why I didn't want to go deep. In enemy backline there with Seth. Maybe Kassadin just dashes on my team and kills them randomly, I don't know. I'm getting like 7k HP with gold. I don't know if that many resists. You guys are hurting a lot, a lot. I lost a lot of HP. Nobody cleared that wave. And my tenacity elixir is expiring, so I'll get. Cleared by Nocturne for uh, Tears. There's Thunder in this play. For the best. I guess I need that fight on my back line. That's a scene. Probably. Low messy. GG report volley, guys. Everybody report volley, bro. That's the useless kick damage to structures, by the way. <laughs> CSK, nice item.